decided I might film this. Uh, I tried to film something for Dokkan last night, and it went terribly. Um, so, uh, you know, um, I've never fought this guy. Alright, yeah, I've never fought this guy, so I figured I would record my first attempt. Um, I have an extreme and super tech team ready to fight this guy. I figured I would pop their active now because I believe you can only use it when the opponent is above a certain health threshold. Um, and uh, by the time they appear next, I'm... Oh, well, I was assuming maybe they wouldn't be able to use it, but maybe they would have. Uh, this team is a bit more of a throwaway team just to kind of whittle them down before the super tech team. I don't know what units I brought. Something. <laughs> It would be funny. Uh, it would be funny to uh, defeat him with this team before. You get stuff when you get hit, Lucio, right? He gets defense with each attack or C. Hey, I'm just gonna do this. And I don't care if he gets a super attack. I am going to save the orbs for someone else. I wonder how he takes them. <laughs> Very well. I I don't really have any context for how strong this guy is, and in order to get all these units, I'm on just kind of a double 120%, so not exactly the uh, strongest you'll ever see this in Zamasu, especially considering I think I only have it at 55%. Oh, under a million Janenda, feeling dangerous, I see. Oh, he can super a lot. I mean, Janemba's guarding should be fine, right? <laughs> Maybe. Alright, well, this is going... This is going. I think that's how I want to say that. Um, how do I do this? I think I get a super attack with him. I would like to, but... Oh well. This is not the greatest team. It is a mishmash of a bunch of random units. <laughs> the extreme teams are not usually uh, the greatest. For, um, I usually use them early on and save the super teams for later. There are some extreme teams you can get away with using later on. I think extreme physical is pretty good now, especially with Super Saiyan 3 Rosé. Um, oh, STR because uh, the coolers, really, honestly. Yeah, I think I still would have been able to use their active. When can they... Above 35%? Oh my goodness, I thought it was like above 70%. Well, probably should have said that. Uh, does Janemba get a super attack? He needs to. Okay, well, I think. There we go. This is probably a bad idea, not letting them get a super attack, but oh well. Or not giving them any fees so they don't have any of their abilities, it's fine. I mean, even if I die with this team, I'm kind of expecting to. Would be nice to go infinite, though. 
Ooh! These androids are still really solid. I am happy they made them as good as they were. It's a shame that the new Int androids aren't very good, but it's not like I could even have them yet, so it doesn't even matter. <laughs> well, I think I die, right? <laughs> I think this is death. <laughs> Yep. All right. On to a super tech team. I mean, we got him down to 39% with that filler team. Um, how do I want to build this? I mean, probably these two. So that way I can get everyone on the team. Because if I get Bardock, I can see super attacks. Do I want him, though? Like... Yeah, honestly, I don't. <laughs> like, I mean, if I if I use him as a lead, is he on powerful combat? He might be. It. Um, I don't think he is. That's some horse shit. Oh well. Um, these guys easy aid recently. They're probably the best option, but I do kind of really want to bring these guys. Mm, that's a lot of only 58%. <laughs> I'm gonna bring this guy. <laughs> um, so if this goes... Man, this Goku is so freaking cool. I love him so much. Um, so, I mean, this is exactly how we do this. Uh, I don't remember if Goku gets anything for getting multiple orbs. I'm fairly certain he does not. And I think he should live this. <laughs> Super attacking immediately. How kind of you to do that. How much does he take here? Oh, oh my god, he's the goat. Honestly, like, I currently have on my profile Handy Vegito as my favorite character. I could see myself making him my favorite character for my profile. He's so cool. Low class warrior buff moment video I tried to film last night was, uh, low-class warriors against Fusion Zamasu, but really it was mostly just me complaining that the only low-class warrior buffs they release are... new. It was a different super attack. Uh... Man, that threw me off. <laughs> But, uh, low-class warriors really only get, um, Fizz or Tech. Those are the only buffs they've gotten in forever. Like, I was trying to take on Fusion Zamasu, and literally the most recent STR unit is that free-to-play Turlet. Um, and other than that, it's just, like, Raid Ape Raditz, which, as much as he is, like, my most nostalgic character, um, from early on in this game, uh, his easy A wasn't exactly stellar, so... <laughs> it's just miserable. Like, there's a lot of Fizz units for early on, um, and Tech doesn't really do very well, because, like, Goku's fine, because he can guard, but, like... <laughs> I tried bringing Bardock, I think. I think that's why it went so horribly poorly. Because I brought Bardock and Ghost up here, and it just still did not. No, I brought Bardock and, um, Whis, and even with a Whis, I think he took 240k from a normal? Oh, no, that was, um, from an AoE. He took about 14k after supering with the Whis up. Um, maybe 28k, something like that. He might have been fine if it wasn't for the AoE, but those AoEs are just so devastating. 
And base trunks takes him out. Well. We love to see it. Uh You know, I that definitely could have gone worse. Will it show me uh the I think it shows you the yeah, the history here. And uh yeah, that's about uh, among us, woo!